Hey, this is an impromptu video unboxing as I got three films today and I just we ain't gonna show them off, we was gonna do like a bigger update but I went what the hey let's do it and if you don't know who I am by now I'm Tezza also known as Sky Loves Gory Movies I'm the gal behind Sky Loves Gory Movies so <clears throat> sorry because ah, I don't want to stretch myself and I really want to stretch myself but I can't so anyway let's get into this I have two steelbooks and one DVD but I'm gonna do the DVD last because there's a little story behind it and I'll tell you about it in the end right first one well of course I've got two steelbooks so this one is a studio canal release and it's region A and B lot. So this is good. Um it was nominated for seven Oscars and it was it won the Academy Award for Best Director and it also won five BAFTAs including Best Film and this film came out in 1967 originally and it actually stars Dustin Hoffman and I think I saw this on oh, I can't remember but I saw it on a very very popular YouTube channel and I've been waiting for it to go down in price so it can be a good price and I got this for Seven ninety nine, and of course it is the graduate. So I've never, do you know what? I've never ever seen this, and I've always been intrigued by, it. always been intrigued to want to watch it. So let's do the all important unboxing. Ah! I know I ripped it. Hate ripping stuff. Look, naughty me. So of course that's the back to it. So that's the front, the side, and then the back says, "Mrs. Robinson, are you you're trying to seduce me?" I think it was a. I think it's the famous tagline from the film. Just a plain disc, but what's impressive is this. This is the um, inside artwork for the graduate. There's Dustin Hoffman there. Very very pleased. I have this finally in my collection. I think it was James Higgins DVD collector nineteen seventy four that actually talked about this, but I'm not a hundred percent certain. So there you go. There's the graduate. So, put that there. Next happens to be my favourite film that isn't horror. Um, I think this came out in 72. No, 71. Sorry. It's 1971. Um, this is an upgrade from me from DVD, which was given to me by a little prick. Use my language he was an asshole decides to get his brothers to fight his battles for him and say horrible nasty things to me on facebook so i called the cops what do you do what do you do when people are threatening you that's what you have to do these days so before i show you what it is right I also have the t-shirt to this and I wear the t-shirt so so much and I love the film so basically this is the card to it and you'll probably be able to recognize what film I'm on about because of this picture right here this actually stars one of my favorite actors of all time and it's um his name is Malcolm McDowell he was also in Caligula another film I like so I'm on about 
this bad boy by directed by Stanley Kubrick. It's of course a Clockwork Orange. I just love this cover. And that back is just phenomenal. I love this film. So, I think this is Region B Locks. I think it is, but I'm not 100% certain. It'll let me know. It doesn't even let me know on the disc. I love the disc. That is brilliant, that. And that's the scene when he undergoes special treatments. So he ends up from bad to good. I know it's a bit of a spoiler alert, but I just love this film. Amazing! Yeah. Fabulous. I love it. I can't wait to watch this again. I need to do a review on this. Because it's a film I love, so... So, anyway. Enough of me taking sticking this off back of... Parcels. Um, steel box, they had the steel box out the way. Next comes the DVD, right? I will explain the story behind it. Um, the other night, it was only Tuesday night that I ordered this and it come today. I got a text about 2 a.m. from Ross, aka Rossy Boy 19, and we were talking away. I said, Oh, I'm just looking through stuff on Amazon. He, he thought that he woke me up. But I also looked at his review, which he's done a fabulous review, as always. And I said to him, you know, you keep on going on at me about this film, like, get this film, get this film. And he was going, he texted me back, going, yeah, yeah. I said, well, I can't get it anywhere. And he, and he said, oh, try Amazon. And I went, I already tried Amazon, it's sold out. And he said, so he said to me, try it again, you might, you might be lucky. Now they want for this DVD seven pounds off Amazon, no like delivery and that. I actually got I went through because you can get like cheaper deals. I actually got this DVD for just un, under under five pounds, so it was like two pound less than what Amazon like Amazon do like a deal with the order directly with them instead of a seller. Then it's free delivery. So I get it. I ordered it Tuesday night and it was here Thursday morning and I've ordered others and they haven't come before this and I was like, this is crazy, this. Absolutely crazy. And the film I'm on about is this, All Cheerleaders Die. I have been searching for this film for six, I think it was about six months. Couldn't get it anywhere. I've tried, I tried online, I tried in the shops. I've been searching for this for months and months and months. Couldn't find it. And a seller on Amazon was selling it for, including postage, it was £4.91, brand new, sealed, including delivery. So I was over the moon. So this is the slip cover, comes with it, front and the back. So... And of course it's still sealed, so that's the front, the back, the sides. So I really thank, I'm just going to say this properly, thank you so much Ross for like making sure it was, it was, it was there and online and stuff like that. No, oh, I'm in my world by my own. So I'm sorry about that. So plastic taken off so yep front back sides and there's the disc so I will be watching this very soon and I know people have already done like a review on it but I will do a review on it there's a couple I still need to do a review on and I forgot to say this a while ago, but um, just to end, because it is movie related, um, I ordered about two, three months ago a DVD from America. Um, 
don't worry i've got it it's effing but i have never ever like showed it on camera so maybe when i do my overview which i'll be doing that very soon i will be showing you off and i actually got a couple of months ago don't go to the reunion which is directed by kevin summerfield i haven't seen it yet but when i get a chance to see it that'll be another review in the works so i'm gonna end this video now because i'm starving i haven't yet eaten anything in about six seven hours and i'm pretty well hungry so stay gory you better have, you all better had stay gory and please have some unpleasant dreams ta-ta for now bye